1966, when I was 12, the only woman who seemed bold enough to get whatever she wanted was Taddy McKee. Cookie, more ice, please. Then into our lives came another bold and daring woman. April Dancer, the girl from UNCLE. She was a secret agent, brash and courageous, and Grace and I wanted to be just like her. Open Channel D. Come in, Channel D. This is Channel D. Target has been sighted. Our data bank contains no profile of this guy. It is imperative we determine his identity. Preparing to plant listening devices. Go, go, go! Mission accomplished. Ready? Ow! What on earth? Over here, I want to introduce you to someone. Bo Fairmont. This is my daughter Grace and her friend Hannah. How oh, do you do? I thought I sent some company. Your eyes. You look just like your mama did when she was your age. He was charming, sophisticated, and mysterious. And he saw right through our cover. Bo was at Ashmore Academy when I was at the Pines. Now he's in Washington, D.C., isn't that right? And then came the words that told us everything we needed to know about Bo Fairmont. Actually, I'm with the Foreign Service. Bo Fairmont was a spy. Of course he's a spy. Everyone knows that Foreign Service is code for the CIA. And did you see the way he kissed Taddy's hand? Did I? Apparently the Cold War wasn't as cold as we thought. Exactly the way Agent X kissed April Dancer in Zarbakistan last week on TV. Taddy, you sure make a mean man of Thank you. So, Mr. Fairmont, what brings you back to Ashmore? Oh, just some family business which I must attend to. Oh, would you stay for dinner? Look at that watch. Oh, he's probably taking our picture. Or my blood pressure. I am free for dinner on Wednesday. Can Hannah come? Well, I don't see why not. Wednesday it is. Ladies, it has been a pleasure. I'll walk you out. Oh, sure, he was charming and debonair, and his smile stole our breath away. But they train spies to be like that, just to fool you. Remember, those hands are licensed to kill. As it turned out, Grace's house wasn't the only one filled with intrigue that week. Look at this. Hill Ridge Furniture has drastically reduced the prices on all coffee and end tables. Why just coffee and end tables? I got it, I got it, don't anyone get it, I got it. Rayburn Residence. Yes, hi. Uh, Who's she talking to? She wants to have a private conversation, that's her business. Who was that? Nobody. Suddenly Hill Ridge is trying to move all their tables. Why now? Just someone selling insurance or water softeners, something, nothing. Do I smell meatloaf? I'm cooking white fish. Since when does white fish smell like meatloaf? Usual, Grace had forced Taddy to buy us official girl from Uncle Walkie Talkies. Hannah? Hello? Hello? 
which were perfect, within about five feet. Shirley, oh, you scared me. <laughs> it's our new book club book, The Spy Who Came In From The Cold. Don't you just love it? Shirley, where's the new cutter? But these things worked perfectly in the commercials. Oh, forget it. We have bigger problems. What? Like, our name. All spies have aliases. Like April Dancer. So, if we're gonna be top secret agents, we're gonna need better names. Something more mod. But what's wrong with our names? Hi, Hannah. Hi, Grace. Okay, what are our choices? I was thinking. I'll be Nicole Storm. And you can be Bella Wild with an E. Cool. As I contemplated my new mod name, something strange happened. Grandma Ida! Cookies! Oh, don't drop them. Ashley, look at this. Hill Ridge Furniture is having a sale on all love seats. You'll love the savings. All prices slashed. Now I'm starting to get annoyed. Yeah. Ma, what are you doing here? Ida, is everything all right? Yeah, I just brought some cookies. Is that okay with you? Of yeah, course. Sure, good. Okay. Yeah, thank thanks. you. Thanks. If April you Dancer was a 65-year-old Jewish woman, she could have been my grandmother. Who is there? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know who your huh? sister's talking to? She's your sister. She's some new guy. What do I know? Oh, she's suddenly so friendly. <laughs> well, he's just hanging in his timesheet to get paid. What? Nothing. I trust her. <laughs> why did he say that? I don't know why. Well, she, uh, she's traveling a lot. She's a modern woman. No, I, I didn't mean anything. <laughs> Come on, Ma. Debbie. Yeah, she got a manicure last week at High Point. Look at her. She's flirting like a college girl. Hey, America, you think your family's funny? We found eight families who believe their lives are funny enough to be a sitcom. From sisters with hot flashes to hot twin sisters, ex-punk rockers to garage banders, Mr. Mom to Manic Mom, and coupon clippers to hillbillies. The competition is fierce in this crazy family feud, but only one household will win the chance to fly to Hollywood and star in their very own sitcom. My Life is a Sitcom premieres January 20th at 8, 7 central on ABC Family. Mr. Murphy has a bad cold <laughs> and a sore throat. But before his class starts, he's going to discover the power of Theraflow. I got chills. And this is nice and warm. It's already soothing my throat. Then Theraflow's strong medicine will quickly give complete relief to cold and flu symptoms. Bring on the scholars. Get fast-acting Theraflu. Nothing soothes you better. Try new Theraflu Vapor Stick. Soothing vapor relief without the mess. When my family loves what we're eating, we talk about it. This is new. What's it called? Gasolina. Gasolina. Smoked cheeses. Give the sausage. Really? I love the way they have the sun-dried tomatoes right in the sauce. It's so good. Just a little wine. Delicious. Eight ninety-five. That's a great price. Chicken so tender. Try the mushroom. Nice and fresh. I always say, you want to cook Italian? You got to cook bread. And I always say, you want to cook? Be my guest. All of garden. When you're here, you're family. Oh, mama, don't you make me another meatloaf. Forget the mac and cheese. I want some fun pile on a bun. I want a man which please. Make tonight a man which night. I want a man which please. <laughs> You're two years old. Which means you're developing a strong sense of self. This week, yourself is a superhero. You're wearing Pampers Easy Ups. They go up easy, and they fit just like underwear. To you, they're super underwear. Easy Ups. Inspired by toddlers. Created by Pampers.
Mama keeps our house sparkling like sunshine. Mama keeps our house fresh like the springtime. Mama keeps our house clean with the magic. Mama's got the magic of Clorox. Clorox disinfecting wipes. Unlike paper towels, they're a better way to wipe because they don't just clean, they disinfect. Mama's got the magic. Clorox disinfecting wipes. Mama's got the magic of Clorox. Where's Evie? Go tell her dinner's almost ready. She's not here. She just left for her book club meeting. Now? Wednesday evening before dinner? She said someone couldn't meet at the regular time. But where is this meeting? Rome. Oh. Hello? Oh, hi, Shirley. No, you just missed her. Well, she's already on her way to the meeting. The book club meeting. Oh. Goodbye. Shirley. She says there is no book club meeting tonight. Look at this. Now Hillridge is having a sale on all sofas, a blowout sale. They're starting a price war. This could be trouble. <laughs> trouble? No, that's what Grace and I were looking for. So, Mr. Fairmont, what's it like working for the uh, Foreign Service? Well, actually, that's a misnomer. I work for the State Department. Really? And, um, have you ever been behind the Iron Curtain? You know, Russia, the Eastern Bloc, enemy lines. Well, as a matter of fact, I was attached to our embassy in Moscow. And, uh, where else have you been attached? Well, let me see, uh... Cuba, the Congo, Red China? <clears throat> No, no, not, uh... You've been all around the world, haven't you, Mr. Fairmont? Slipping in and out of enemy capitals, fighting oppression, spying against the opponents of democracy. <laughs> and there it was. In my exuberance, I had broken the first rule of being a spy. I blew his cover, put it all on the table, right beside the Bananas Foster. Who? Bo, would you like to join me in the den for some cognac? I would love to join you. Ladies? It was an unforgivable betrayal. I'm so sorry. Don't worry. He is one cool customer. And what are they whispering about? But Bo wasn't the only one to get grilled that night. Where were you? At my book club meeting. Oh, you were? That's what I just said. What is with you? Why are you talking like that? Your hair's wet. No, it's not. It's damp. It's wet. It's humid outside. We're mammals. We sweat. That's how we cool ourselves. Her hair's wet. All of it. I don't know. We're mammals. I got it. I got it. Don't anyone get it. I... Hello? I left it with you? Oh, thanks. I'll, I'll pick it up next week. I had fun tonight, and I didn't think I would. Thank you, Marvin. It was a bizarre time, the Cold War, when outside forces seemed to threaten the security of all we held dear. Marvin. Okay, so is Bo a double agent, or is he on our side? What do you think, Bella? Bella? Bella! Oh, yeah, sorry. Um, I don't know. Okay, 
What we need is a plan. It has to be perfect. Always dangerous words to come out of Grace's mouth. What would the girl from Uncle do? I don't know. Probably sneak into his hotel room. Bella, you're a genius! Jennifer, 26, living for two years with David, 31, armed guard. They met four years ago at a pool hall. I really liked David's smile. The first time I saw Jennifer, I knew she was the one for me. There are a lot of reasons why I don't trust David. I found a picture of him and another girl. Now they've got five days to make it or break it at The Last Resort, an all-new reality series. Real people, real relationships, real decisions. Monday, starting January 20th on ABC Family. That's some sleeping pill. Mmm, herbal. There's something about herbal essences. The fragrance, the natural botanicals. Yes! It wakes up. Yes! Every part of you. Oh! Ah! Herbal essences. Big flavor is coming your way. Introducing Domino's Dots, 360 degrees of all-around gooey, delicious cinnamon fun. Get an order free when you buy a large one-topping pizza for $9.99. Only from Domino's. Get the door. Quick, it's free Domino's Dots. He's just terrific, and he's brought uh, kind of a reptilian sense of uh, balance uh, to business that I think was missing from our uh, warm-blooded uh, employees before. Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. Sometimes when we touch why do people love Geico? The honesty is too much. And I have to close my eyes. Because 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. Awesome concert. And it stinks. Yeah, I know it's great weed, huh? <laughs> awesome concert. <laughs> oh, what's up, rookie? It's awesome concert. I'm so stunned. Do you remember where we were sitting? <laughs> From the comfort of home, you can buy a wide variety of products at tremendous prices on Shop NBC. Whether it's the latest fashion forward looks or everyday basics, we have high quality jewelry at low prices. Plus, brand name watches, home decor items to brighten any room, health and beauty products from names you can trust, blazing fast computers and high-end electronics. Tune in for never seen before offers all month right from the convenience of home. Shop NBC, the new shopping network. today and receive free installation plus six months at $29.95 a month 866-321-CABLE every secret agent knows that sometimes plan A blows up in your face I'm sorry we don't give out the room number of our guests and when it does you revert to plan B leave a message for Mr. Bo Fairmont? Yes. What is it? Uh, his dry cleaning is ready. Yeah. Certainly. Thank you. to my hair appointment. Ma, I told you, I can't take you. I have a meeting. What meeting? There's no one else to drive you. Just take the cab. Hello? Hello. Every week. 
Be a good girl. <laughs> okay. Take the cab. Where to, lady? Come on. Do you really think April Dancer would have gone to her hair appointment? Follow that car. The primary requirement for being a secret agent is having nerves of steel. Grace had nerves of steel. I, on the other hand, had nerves of jello. Here, go put these back. We could be seen. Ugh. We're gonna get caught. I just know it. Relax, Bella. The hard part is over. We're in. And suddenly, I wasn't afraid. I was no longer Hannah Rayburn, a girl from Ashmore, North Carolina. I was Bella Wilde, with an E. Now, we don't know why this beau came to visit Taddy, or what he really wants from her. But if he really is a double agent, she could be in great danger. Let's spread out. Maybe we'll find some microfilm or some top secret thingy. He has a foreign cleaner. French. Nice and easy. Just let's be careful, okay? There we go. Oh, look, they're cute little bottles. No! Might be tear gas or knockout pills. Go, go, go! Sock. Wait a second. Why would a man have only one sock under his bed? <gasps> Bella, look, a hotel bag. What's written on it? Nothing. <gasps> Invisible ink. Let's try this. Anything? No. Obviously, he's smarter than we thought. While our search uncovered only a few dust balls and an orphan sock, Grandma Ida was about to hit pay dirt. <laughs> How do I look, Marvin? What is all this? Ma, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? I'm learning to swim. Tuesday night at the movies, a pretend marriage sparks a true love story. Keanu Reeves stars in A Walk in the Clouds. Tonight at 8, 7 Central on ABC Family. Who are you? Your guardian angel. You forgot to dial 1-800-COLLECT. 1-800-COLLECT for collect calls. He gets it. Oh, I get it. I do now. <laughs> Good boy. Gotta fly. 1-800-COLLECT. Save a buck or two. Holiday bills arrived? KFC can help with amazing savings on original recipe chicken. For a limited time, get a 7-piece bucket of legs and thighs for only 5 bucks, or a 14-piece bucket of legs and thighs for only 10. Enjoy America's favorite chicken today. Hurry! I have to warn the beast! It's your last chance to own Disney's Beauty and the Beast, the best-reviewed DVD of the year. You don't have time to be timid. Because on January 31st, it goes back into the Disney vault for 10 years. Get it before it's gone. Plastic holds the promise of a better world, taking medicine to new heights and giving our lives greater comfort. It's in the packaging that protects us and a pacemaker to empower us, every day touching every generation. From the ambulance to the emergency room, it puts the answers in our hands and hope in our hearts. For a safer, more brilliant tomorrow, plastics make it possible. Where's Matt? I forgot, didn't you? No. But just call him. No, you think I'm an idiot. Hello? Hello to you, too. Slideshow? Absolutely right. You have the uh, cable in your hands, right? Yes, I do. I will put that down. Right. Take out the memory stick to hop it right into the front of the TV. Isn't that just fantastic? Yo, thank you so much for calling. Paris. Paris. Oh! really up on all this technology, huh? Skip stuff. Boom, boom, boom. Clearly designed by men, which 
means it could be a long time before you can check your pad. Fortunately, new Always Thin Ultra absorbs so much you'll get five times cleaner, drier protection, which is five times better than other pads. So you can go the distance. Five times cleaner and drier. Always. Expect more protection. What we choose to keep secret is always personal. And certainly my mother had her reasons for keeping her private swimming lessons private. Because David already thinks I can swim. Why would he think that? Because I told him. I'm so ashamed. I have never lied to David, except when it was absolutely necessary. And now we're going on vacation to Lake Lure. So I don't want to get caught in a lie. So instead, you lied twice? OK. But lying twice and not drowning is better than lying once and sinking to the bottom of the lake. I can't argue with that. So now I guess I'll just have to tell David the truth. <laughs> not so fast, Esther Williams. Husbands don't need to know everything. So maybe there's a mother-daughter special? Hello? <laughs> Turns out my mother wasn't the only one keeping a secret. explained a lot. Wait a minute. It's her old diary. And then we did something any good spy would do, but any good daughter shouldn't. We read it. Look, she must have stopped reading here. September 2nd. Bo left for college without even a look my way. My heart aches for him. Yet, all that remains is a glove which I stole from his pocket. Oh, the scent of lime mixed with old spice. How can love be so cruel? Just miss Bo. He's on his way back to Washington. He asked me to say goodbye. Goodbye? Again? Oh, Daddy, you must feel awful. Well, no, sweetie. It was a lovely visit. You know, Bo had a little schoolboy crush on me before he went to college, but I just didn't feel the same way. Although I can still remember his scent when he kissed me. Lime and old spice. Mm. I wanted to believe what Taddy said, but somehow I knew that what she wrote in her diary was the real truth. And for the first time I realized, Taddy didn't get everything she wanted. And that made me like her even more. So I snuck into Hill Ridge Furniture and talked to a salesman, pretended to be a customer, and guess what? They're going out of sofas altogether and going into office furniture. Oh, that's great. Mm. <laughs> and they thought they could hide something from me. <laughs> the girl from Uncle only lasted a season on TV. And neither Grace nor I grew up to be a spy. Go, go, go. I better not hear anybody. But we both learned something about the truth. Not only could it be elusive and tricky, sometimes it just takes you by surprise. <laughs> are funny enough to be a sitcom. Let's get to know one of them. America, meet the Millers of New Hope, Pennsylvania. 
Mom's spinning a lot of plates. Good work, kids, gentlemen callers. Big Sis is hot to trot with the fellas. Little Sis is a whiner. And Junior is a prankster surrounded by nothing but estrogen. Can this high-flying family circus bring down the curtain on the competition?